What's up, my YouTubers? Oh, there we go, guys. Uh, yeah. Well, I just recorded a whole video on my last task. And, you know, I just realized at the end of it, I muted audio on it for something I was doing earlier. And it made me pretty damn pissed off. Anyways, today I got a bone crusher. Because I got a like, 40k dungeon XP. All I do is do smalls with my mate. And I done that for about 3 or 4 hours. And it was pretty damn fun. Now yeah, I want to talk about a few things. I want to talk about bonus XP weekend. I want to talk about the way Jagex are going. And a little bit about the UAC. So yeah, let's get... Uh, first of all, uh, what I'm doing for bonus XP weekend. <coughs> I will be doing construction, in fact. I have 99 banked, and that will be around 85k oak planks. Which is approximately 45 mil. And yeah, do you know what pissed me off though about not recording the last time? I had uh, got 80 Slayer in it. In that video, I got 80 Slayer. Do you know how devastating that is to not have that on video? I felt like cut myself, to be honest. Cut myself deep. Now, well, the Halloween event came out today, and I could not be bothered doing it because I remember doing last year's, and it was really, really bad. And the things you get from it is just stupid. Like, really. And that kind of brings me to the topic on the content Jagex are bringing out lately. Like, for instance, the Hunter con, like, the Big Chin Chompers. Now, that's like the biggest waste of development time I've ever seen. It's dead content, and yeah. The only recent good content I've actually seen them do is like, the challenges. Like, as I was saying back here, I was done, um, a challenge for like, I think it was get 49 kills or some of the shit for your Slayer assignment and I did that and I legit got 5.6k XP that's like really good that's a really really good like add on to your um, challenges yeah but like really most of the content these days from Jagex is just you know, shit and it's all got to do with the squirrel fortune all this shit oh we got two spins I just realized that I'm gonna do these spins these are from. Hold on, let's see what I get. Oh yeah! Oh, medium XP lamp. That's, I'll take that. Um, what can I do with this? Slayer. Yeah, yeah but like really, uh, most, most of the content is shit. Shit, 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 shit. It's all boring. Like, like, like the beta, the beta is so bad, yet they still want to bring it out. It has had such negative feedback, and yet they're still going to bring it out and ruin the game. Like I could accept it if they're going to bring it out in RuneScape 3 and leave up a RuneScape 2 server, server up, but like literally, it's so shit. It's not RuneScape at all. They should change the name to like World of like no, World of RuneCraft. That's what it should be called. Because I was at this internet cafe, I think it was yesterday. Because I don't know what I was doing there, I was just with my girlfriend there. And this guy was on World of Warcraft, and it looks pretty much exactly the same now. And it's just bad. It's not RuneScape at all anymore. RuneScape used to be like, you know, the time where you used to have to like cut trees and fucking fire make and talk to people, or like sit there and wood cutting, telling each other how good you are. And like, t these days you can't even talk to someone in RuneScape without getting fished or like try to get like key logged and all this crap. It's really shit and it's really, it's really sad to be honest. Yeah, and basically the, what, the things that are ruining this game is like the flowers. I don't see why Jagex just can't to like change every single flower you plant to be red like they did on the beta servers. Like, I know there's like flowers are needed for summoning and that, but it's better than all these people getting scammed and all these people real world trading and stuff. Like, for instance, then like people that got banned, like Windle Day and Stokenut and all that, they got like banned and Stokenut's like admitted to selling over $500,000 worth of 
like RuneScape Gold to gold websites. And to be honest, if I was him, I'd be pretty chuffed. And also, another thing I'll talk about is me and video making. Like, I want to make videos, but I also want people to watch my videos. But I don't think many people would actually watch my videos. I know some of my friends do, but yeah. I do not know how to get started, like, how to advertise and how to, like, let's say, get out there and, like, get my channel known because I'm keen to make videos every day. Like, you know, I find it, I enjoy it. But I just want people to watch, also enjoy watching my videos. So, yeah. I'm, like, planning on having, like, a few series, like, uh, staking adventure series, I like that, like take out, say, 5 mil, to see what you can make out of it, and staking series, uh, road to max, I'll probably do every month or so, but for me to do this, I'll probably need people to watch me, because it's very demotivating seeing no one watch your videos at all, and like, yeah, but anyway guys, I probably should wrap it up, um, video tomorrow, most likely. And yeah, catch you guys later.